Hi, this is Mike with AskTractorMike.com. I really hope this video gets shared a lot because I'm going to talk about a really dangerous situation I witnessed recently. Uh, when, when you're doing something dangerous with your tractor, normally you're only putting yourself in danger. But when you load it on a trailer and haul it down the open road and, and you have a problem, you're putting other people in danger as well. I'd never actually seen this situation before. I've talked about negative tongue weight, and I knew it was dangerous. When, when you're loading a trailer, you want about 10% around that amount of the weight of whatever you're hauling pushing down on the back of the trailer, on the, on the tongue of the trailer. If you have it totally level, or if you have weight pulling up on the back of the trailer, you have a real problem. And I've, I've been preached that my whole life. I've never actually witnessed it until I have twin daughters that recently moved to Chicago. And my wife and I rented a U-Haul trailer and went to Chicago and took bedding to, to my daughters. On the way back, we witnessed a person that was driving down Interstate 55 in the middle of nowhere in Illinois, hauling a subcompact tractor loaded backwards on the trailer. And when you back a tractor on a trailer, the engine weight is pulling up on the back of your pickup truck and it created a situation that was a danger to everyone that was around that vehicle. And I almost had my wife take a video of it, but I, I didn't want to embarrass the person if they saw it, and I, I, did, I didn't want to worry about having their license plate in view. But they were going slow enough, they were keeping it on the road. But what happens when you have negative tongue weight is the trailer will go back and forth behind the truck, and it is scary. They were probably doing between 35 and 40 miles an hour, and that was all it could do. If they got any above that, the thing started jacking around, and if they'd, if they'd have done 50 miles an hour, it would have taken the whole truck right off the road, and, and it, it made them change lanes. It would have been totally out of control. Now, the best example of this in a video, there's a link below to a video done by an Australian company that sells parts to the recreational vehicle industry. And they talk about loading a, 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 a trailer, uh, an RV trailer, on, on the back of a truck and getting the weight on the tongue. But they show an example of what happens when you have negative tongue weight. And I highly recommend that you watch it to see what happens if you don't have weight on the tongue of your trailer on the back of your pickup truck. And, and guys, stay safe. And this, this counts any size trailer, from, from a little single axle trailer like this one to the biggest trailer. You have to have tongue weight pushing down on you, and, that, and that'll keep you safe. So, so watch the video in the link below. It's only a couple of minutes long. They talk about kilometers and everything because it's Australian, but it's important to watch it to keep you safe and the people on the highway safe. I survive on web traffic. I'd really like you to share this video with other people because I, I don't ever want to witness this again. And subscribe to my YouTube channel and like my Facebook page. If you have questions or comments, put them down below. We'll try to get back with you. Thanks for watching.